new here at 11 o'clock. A couple told News Center 7 a man was acting like an officer and almost ran them off the road. And they had their two kids in the car with them. I'm James Brown. And I'm Gabrielle Enright. This happened in South Montgomery County. News Center 7's Taylor Robertson is live now where police arrested the suspect. And Taylor, the couple told you they do not want this to happen to anyone else. James, Gabby, his name is Dennis Mead. I got a hold of the Springboro police report that says that police arrested Mead in this Kroger parking lot on West Central Avenue after he admitted that he tried to pull a couple over on I-75. Well, he hit the shoulder, acting like he was a cop, hit his lights, and then got behind us. Kristen Hale and her boyfriend, Adam Holland, were in the car with their four and six-year-olds. We was getting on the highway, and this guy about rear-ended us. Holland said they pulled onto 75, and Meade tried to hit them several times. The police report said he knew something was wrong when Meade got behind them and turned on what could resemble police lights. And I was like, that's not a cop, so I just kept on going. He called 911 and got off the highway. The report said a real Springboro officer saw Meade's car and stopped him. Meade admitted he was not a police officer and he tried stopping the couple. Police searched his SUV and found several things they said made it look like a police cruiser. I mean, his windows, he's got the wheels that the cop cars have, he's got the spotlight, he's radios. got everything. He's got the PA, the radios, the sirens, he's got it all. Police found a loaded gun in Meade's waistband and a loaded magazine in his pocket. It was loaded and he was doing that like, what could have like, happened? Troopers did arrest Meade in this parking lot, and he was charged with a misdemeanor for impersonating a peace officer. We're live in Springboro. Taylor Robertson, News Center 7. And tonight I talked with Centerville police about what drivers should do if they see flashing police lights behind them. The department told me the law says drivers need to pull over immediately if it's safe to do so. It is not legal for drivers to keep going to a populated area. Officers could see that as an attempt to get away. If a driver is concerned for their safety, after they pull over, they should call.